as hard a title shot to come by as there is in any UFC division is at 155 pounds. Here he is, the consensus number one lightweight title challenger, the number one contender, at least in terms of the rankings, getting set for a title fight here tonight. A lot of people think he is a live underdog in this championship setting. I guess we'll find out here, Joe Rogan. As he makes his way towards the cage, his preparation has been perfect. He is in fantastic shape, had an amazing camp, and he believes that he is in the perfect position to become the new champion of the world. As he steps into the octagon right now, he steps in with a champion's mindset. All right, here he is, the reigning defending undisputed UFC lightweight champion of the world. Of course, the target is on his back. All eyes are on this man tonight as he tries to make good on yet another title defense. He has owned this division for some time. The question is, as the challenges get stiffer, can he remain the hunted? Several championship fights to his credit, a lot of 25-minute wars. As he gets older, the challenges get stiffer. We'll see how he handles this one tonight. The champion is in focus. He is in his prime. He's making his way towards the cage. His training for this camp has been absolutely spectacular. He believes he has a solid game plan, and his mentality coming into this fight is clear and focused. And now our tail of the tape for this lightweight scrap. So a more than five year gap between these two fighters when it comes to the age, with the same height and a similar reach. Now to get a start of the veteran voice of the octagon, Bruce Buck. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Mergliata. This is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold-out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City, it's time! Five round for the undisputed UFC Lightweight Championship of World. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a jiu-jitsu fighter, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet ten inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Sliding out of Las Vegas, Nevada, presenting the challenger, Bam Bam. And now introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a grappler, holding a professional record of 27 wins, no losses. He stands 5 feet 10 inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting out of the Republic of Pakistan, Russia, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC lightweight champion of the world, Habib the Eagle. This has been one of the most highly anticipated matchups for a long time. And ladies and gentlemen, strap yourselves in because it's about to go down right, right now. All right, here we go. UFC lightweight title on the line. Well done to catch the kick. We'll see what he can do. Gonna step over, full mount now. Oh, beautiful, beautiful right hand by the champion. He's got half guard. That's a clean left hand. Tags him with a flush left. He's working from full mount again. Good defense here on the ground. He's got that one arm trapped. 
Look at this reversal. Neither guy doing much at this point. He's putting his hands down on the thighs. He's looking to pass. Oh, he gets reversed. He's back to full mount again. Oh, pretty good work here from the bottom, Joe, as he tags him with that punch. He postures into place. He's doing a great job of moving and transitioning here on the ground. Nice reversal here. Just over three minutes to go round one. Showing some good defense here, trapping that arm. Very nice sweep. There's the right. Oh, nice combination of ground and pound here by Nermago Meta. He lands a big shot from the bottom. Oh, he got cracked. Nermago Medov's hammer fist, that one blocked. Looks like he's about to attempt a submission. Here he goes. He's got the leg over the shoulder. Now, he's gonna pull down on his shin. He popped out of the triangle. Moves to half guard. And now he's in full mount. He hip escapes from the full mount. Oh, he postures up in a big hit strike by Nermago Meta. Big elbow to the body there. He's working from side control. He moves to the Mount of Crucifix. This is ugly. And he eats a right hand there. seconds now remain in the round. He's got to move. He's in the Mount of Crucifix now. He's now working from side control again. Excellent movement on the ground here. Constantly moving, constantly staying busy. He's got double underhooks here. Beautiful trip. Half guard now. Ooh, postures up and now goes with the big strike to the body. Well done there by Nermago Medov. <laughs> 45 seconds remain in the round. In half guard now. Excellent movement on the ground here. Always trying to better his position. 30 seconds now to go in the round. Twenty seconds left. Round one winding down here. Now he covers up as the hammer fists are coming. Right. Horn right. sounds for the end of round one. Let's take a look at some of the action in that round here. Here's a nasty ground and pound strike. And here is another ground and pound strike. And here's another powerful ground and pound strike. We really got to see some big time ground and pound in that round. Brittany Palmer is here as well.
All right, here we go with round two. This is going to become... Oh! Huge oh, right hand! This fight is dangerously oh. close to being stopped. Oh. He's got him hurt here. Nice takedown. That strike will count. Big body, body shot. shot there, too. And he's in full guard. Excellent movement and transitions here on the ground. Staying busy. Strong bottom work here. Staying busy. Hip escape. Gets out of the full mount. Nermago Medov gets caught with that punch. He's posturing up here. Tries to pass, but cannot. and change to go in round two. Oh, oh elbow, beautiful elbow. elbow. And he moves into the mount. Under three minutes now to go in the round. Slides him over and nice reversal here. Excellent posture here. Well, you gotta stay busy on the bottom. He's doing it here. Nice punch. Inside control once again. Good shot to the head. Knee to the body again. Excellent movement here on the ground. Just over two minutes to go in round two. He's looking to work that mounted crucifix. Controlling north-south again. Oh, nice work from the bottom. Tags him with the punch. Under two minutes to go in the round. His right eye is really starting to swell. Nice shot to the head. Back to the guard position. Posture's up. Is he as he looks to improve position here? He's in full guard. Lands a good shot from the bottom. Well, this is not a man you want on top of you. Now the elbow to the body as the ground and pound continues to be on point by Nurmagomedov. Showing good defense here, controlling that arm, keeping him from hitting him. Well, just because you're on your back doesn't mean you can't throw off that. Staying busy here. You'd like to see that, Joe. Oh, that's a good strike there by Nermago Meta. Back to half guard. Mounts again. Big shot from the bottom. He hip escapes. He's out of the full mount. He's now working from side control again. Now he's in half guard. He's moved back into side control once more. He's trying to pass there, but he gets stopped. 20 seconds now remain in the round. Final seconds. He's doing a great job of moving and transitioning here on the ground. 
Ten minutes in the books. And there is the horn. Big five minutes for him there. Great round from Nermago Meta. Yeah, that knockdown should have won him the round. It was a big moment in the fight. Let's take a look at that again. Let's see it one more time. Ariane Celeste with us tonight. Here we go, third round of this championship. Oh, kick to the face. This could be it right here. Big shots. Oh, what a leg kick. The left hook hits home. Oh, huge shot there, Lance Flush. Takedown. Beautiful timing with the left hand. Excellent movement on the ground here. Constantly moving, constantly staying busy. He's got the arm trapped of his opponent. Good defense. Nice sweep. Now he's in half guard. It looks to me like he's trying to turn towards either side. Joe doing a nice job here, staying busy from the bottom. Elbow landed there by Nermago Meta. And there's one leg over. He's almost mounted him here. He's got it. He's mounted him. Keep it busy here off of his back. Nice offense from the bottom. Hard left. Well, the strikes keep on coming, and now that eye is so swollen, his vision has to be impaired, Joe. He's in some real trouble. Oh, Nasty elbow. elbow lands to the head. Just over three minutes to go in round three. And lands a good shot. And really starting to make these shots count. Oh, and he is right throwing here. that right with fight-ending intentions. He's out. It's all That's it. And he got the victory from ruthless, brutal ground and pound. Yeah, Joe, that was some throwback style ground and pound. He was trying to pound his opponent's head through the damn canvas. He wasn't looking to score there. He was looking to land big shots and get his opponent out of there. Well, mission accomplished on that front. This is one of the bigger knockout victories of his career. We can see it one more time from a different angle. Ground and pound at its finest. And that is the shot that ends this fight. Here it is one more time. Boom! And then he's out. So what a knockout from the UFC lightweight champion here tonight. Under the bright lights, he rises above the pressure and gets it done in a big way to be the UFC lightweight champion. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Bergliata has called a stop to this contest at two minutes, seven seconds of the third round. Declaring the winner by knockout and still the undisputed UFC lightweight champion of the world, Habib Hikikola Nurmagomedov. So there he is, all smiles, the still undisputed UFC lightweight champion of the world, and what a way to get it done here tonight as he gets it done with the knockout. You talk about maximizing a showcase. I'm just not sure he could have done it any better. Smart approach to the fight, and the window of opportunity opened. He closed the show. Congratulations to the team as they celebrate the title defense here tonight.